Yo, what is going on guys? It's your boy Anthony here. Back today with another YouTube video for you guys. And um, yeah, so today I'm gonna be doing part two of my unanswerable questions. I did part one last week. It, you know, did pretty good. Not too bad, not not too bad, not too good. You know, just did pretty well. Uh, you guys enjoyed it, it seemed like, and you guys gave me some feedback. I know I had a couple people in the comment section, you know, giving me feedback and like answering how they thought the questions went. So, and I really had a good time, you know, like really getting the mind thinking and just thinking about these questions that can't really be answered, but they really get you thinking. So I'm going to do part two today and I have some like funny ones. So it's going to be different. It's going to be a little funny. Maybe I, I don't, I really don't know. I haven't looked at them too deeply, so we'll see. But before we get into the video, uh, I hope you guys are all having a great day and thank you guys for clicking on my video. It means a lot, man. So let's get right into it. So, uh, question number one. Are children who act and rate into our movies allowed to watch the film when it's done? Now, there we go. You know, because they have a lot of, you know, they use a lot of kids in rated R movies. Like, uh, It. Um, <laughs> uh, Sinister, The Conjuring. You know, you can go on and on about all the different scary movies, you know, that have with kids under 18. So, are they allowed to watch the movie when it's done? I feel like they are, but like, that's, you know... How do we know? Because they're under 18, but they're acting in a movie. So I feel like they should be able to watch the movie that they created, but they're under 18, so their friends can't watch it. So it's weird, man. It's weird. Uh, let's see. Question number two. Do they bury people with their braces still on, or do they remove them? Hmm? I never thought about this one. Like, let's say, you know, someone has braces. They die. Do they uh, get buried with their braces? Do they take them off? I honestly couldn't tell you, and I really don't want to go deeper into this question because it's kind of dark, and uh, I don't know. That's just me, though. Um, if a toma if tomatoes are a fruit, is ketchup commit could can't speak? If tomatoes are a fruit, is ketchup can <laughs> if tomatoes is a fruit, is ketchup considered a smoothie? <sighs> I, I don't think so. I don't think anybody would just, you know, sit down, you know, about to watch a movie. They're like, mm, I want a smoothie. What kind of smoothie do you want, Jim? Um, give me a ketchup smoothie. Now, who in their right mind would just say, hey, I want a ketchup smoothie? I know I wouldn't. I don't think any of my friends or family would. But if you guys do, you know, more power to you. Uh, if you guys have, comment down below. Let me know what it tastes, man. It's, I honestly don't know. And um, so why do we cook bacon, you know, but we bake cookies? Hmm. Now think about that one for a second, everybody. How do, why do we cook bacon, but bake cookies? I don't know. I'm not a chef. I'm not Gordon Ramsay, or I could tell you this question. He might know. So if you guys are in contact with Gordon, tell him to hop on this video subscribe like the video and comment down below why we cook bacon but bake cookies if you guys if you guys know you know if you do that's cool let me know okay okay if you hate haters does that make you a hater and will you hate yourself so let's say you know let's say you have haters and you hate the haters are you a hater for hating them and does that make you hate yourself Because you kind of, you know, kind of be, uh, what is it called? I can't think of the word, but okay. Situation. You have haters. You don't like your haters, so you hate them. And then they hate you, so you hate yourself because you hate them. Now, the beard looks nice. <laughs> but, you know, that's, hmm, I never thought about that. Never thought of it like that, have you? No, I haven't. Have you? Negative. I don't know. If you have, comment down below. Uh, <laughs> what would happen if Pinocchio said, my nose will grow now? Hmm? So, <laughs> you know, because Pinocchio, he gets the long nose uh, when he lies. So if he straight up says, look, Samantha, my nose is about to grow. 
is he going to be telling a lie? Or because then he ends up, you know, saying what he's going to say. So is it a lie? Because he's already saying, but he's already telling people. He's already saying, my nose is going to grow. So is that a lie? Because he's not lying that his nose is going to grow. But is he still telling a lie? Because he's still telling a lie. But is his nose going to grow? I don't know, man. These, um, you know, these are really interesting. And they really get the mind thinking. I really, you know, have a good time just looking at these questions that people come up with. And it just, it's just like, wow. I would never think of that. I wouldn't. In my, right, in my right mind, I would never think of this kind of question. It's just, I never think about life, like, I never take life, like, in a deeper meaning, meaning, not meeting, not meeting, meaning like that, you know? And um, so it's really interesting when you look back and you just look at these questions. So, yeah, if you guys want to, you know, look at some more questions, just go ahead and type in, like, unanswerable questions on Google, and it'll bring up a whole list. I have, like, 120 of questions, you know, that I can just sit here and read and, like, ask and, like, give my input on. So, yeah, uh, that's going to be it for this video, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed. Subscribe if you guys are new. And uh, go ahead and hit that like button, man, if you guys enjoyed this video. And if you guys would like to see more videos like this, go ahead and comment down below um like what you guys think about this video and like if you guys have any input on these questions that i asked man yeah uh like i said earlier i hope you guys have a great day and thank you guys for clicking on my video it means a lot and i will see you guys next time out peace